Hey, what is going on guys and welcome your lovely face back to another Far Cry 5 video and of course it is about the full-on first ever announcement trailer that we have got for this game and I am gonna be honest with you guys this hands down is definitely the first ever Far Cry game that I've been like overwhelmed by like I'm, I'm like I can't describe my hype for the game it just looks absolutely fantastic and I really 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 think this may potentially be the best Far Cry game ever ever made and like I'm telling you guys if you agree with me I mean drop a like on this video and if you don't dislike the video but hands down this game looks absolutely phenomenal but that being said I'm gonna be talking about a few little things that we did see in of course the trailer it's not gonna be an analysis but I want to point out a few things that well I guess technically is gonna make this game different and I mean from checking out the trailer that of course you guys can see in the background, the vibe that the game gives off is fantastic. I mean, it doesn't feel like your average Far Cry game if that makes sense, you know. With Far Cry games, I'm used to freaking like bushes and shit, or being in Africa like Far Cry 2. That was a great game by the way, but this, this is just giving a whole nother vibe. I mean, what I, I guess, I, I, I guess a good game to pretty much um, compare this to in terms of the visual wise and like the vibes that it it's giving off and like the theme is kind of like a, a GTA 5 uh, kind of vibe if you know what I mean and there's gonna be one specific scene I'm gonna show you guys right now that made it feel well, or made it give like a GTA 5 vibe and I don't know what it is specifically but it just looks incredible and oh my god I I'm talking like when it comes down to vehicles I mean we're gonna be flying planes which if I'm not mistaken uh, this will be the first ever Far Cry game to essentially let you fly actual planes I mean I could be wrong there okay like don't don't judge me on that but from my Far Cry experience, I'm pretty, pretty sure this is one of the first games that gives you like a whole more variety, if you will, uh, when it comes down to vehicle driving. Now, as far as the whole story goes and the wilderness, I mean, we can see a freaking goddamn bear when you're, <laughs> when you're just driving in your car. And I mean, if you want to take attention to detail, of course, as well, uh, we get, we guys can see like the dude's like mirror is cracked. I mean, small little details always go along way of course hopefully we can actually see out the freaking mirrors where I can tell you that otherwise that's just gonna be irrelevant as fuck um, <laughs> now one thing that a lot of you guys have been actually talking about um, and fans really of the Far Cry series is of course the downgrade oh boy I really didn't want to talk about this downgrade, <laughs> um, but okay, here's a good way to put it, it's Ubisoft, it's gonna happen, but then it could not happen, okay, like, um, the reason why I feel like it's not gonna happen, despite it happening every single time previously, like, I have no ways to sort of back up my point to say it's not gonna happen, but if you want to go to like a complete different game of theirs, Watch Dogs 2 wasn't downgraded. Hey, let's let's take a look at that, hey, because when we saw the E3 stuff and all that for Jiggly Weekly, I mean, I literally said we're gonna get a downgrade. Like, I was positive as anything, okay? Like, I could have put money, I could have put my life savings on that. I was that freaking positive. There was gonna be a downgrade, and I mean, when the game came out, it looked exactly the same as it did when we actually saw it at E3. Now, that being said and all, I still do want to see some first hand gameplay which of course we are going to see at E3 so until then I'm not exactly going to say there could be a downgrade um, but taking a look at this trailer visuals wise <laughs> let's be real of course it, it, it is one of those trailers where of course you know hey of course everything's like overly freaking graphicated even though that's not a freaking word we're gonna use that okay and the definition to that means where they're running this thing on like a freaking monster that probably no one actually has apart from Ubisoft so <laughs> when it comes down to that yes of course it's gonna be a little bit like a little bit of cuts and stuff um, but I mean like I said we gotta see some first-hand gameplay play right I want to make another video uh, later on in the in, well in the next couple of days about the driving and stuff like that when it comes down to the physics and that um, but as far as the trailer goes and the story it truly does look like it could potentially be the best ever Far Cry game ever 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 made and probably may well be the best ever in the future to come made as well it feels like it's gonna be that good okay but 
it could always be, you know, knocked down by a whole bunch of Jiggly Wigglies. But we're not going to get too much into that. But like I said, vehicles and quad bikes and planes and freaking, oh, I mean, like muscle cars. It, it's there, you know. It is actually there. But guys, let me know what you think of this in the comment section below. Do you think it's going to get downgraded? Do you think it is the best ever Far Cry game made as of to date? Get in the comment section below and let me know your thoughts. And also, if there's something you want to see in this game uh, make an appearance, by all means, leave that in the comment section below as well because I really really want to do a lot of speculations on things that I as a fan of the series and you know as a gamer myself would like to see in a game in an open world shooter game it's just slash fucking amazing looking game like this pretty much but guys it is gonna wrap up this video here I hope you really enjoyed it as always subscribe if you are new to the channel for more awesome content but that being said I hope you guys have yourselves an absolutely ridiculously amazing day but until the next one guys, adios amigos.